So recently, I recently uploaded a video and on my channel I have like a, a series of videos that I do on my channel and they are aimed for small YouTubers, but not just any small YouTubers, they are aimed for small Namibian YouTubers where I give them shout outs and I help them with um, promoting them a bit, just pushing them up a bit because I am a small Namibian YouTuber and and on my series I talk about small Namibian YouTubers and the thing that happened is that um, I get a lot of comments on my channel but I never really get comments like from big 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 YouTubers and and one of these YouTubers happened to be Wardemeyer if you don't know who Wardemeyer is uh, Wardemeyer is a big successful Ghanaian YouTuber that started this uh, movement I think like two or three years ago called Africa to the world where he travels he's like a travel youtuber he travels around Africa like promoting uh, the richness and the beauty of Africa since there is a very big misconception when it comes to Africa and Africans so he came up with this concept of taking Africa to the world through his uh, content and he is very very successful and uh, he happened to come across my video that I did for small Namibian YouTubers and the, the, I don't really know how he came across my video and I was like star starstruck when he came across my video and he left me a comment and I have some theories on how he came across my videos one of the theories which is not really proven was that Bodemeyer had been in Namibia like a month or two months ago and he had done a couple of collaborations with local Namibian YouTubers and I happen to follow these local Namibian YouTubers and I'm always in their comment sessions, always commenting. So my theory is probably he would have picked up one of my comments in these local Namibian YouTubers that he follows that he had made collabs with. Maybe that's my theory that he had picked up my, one of my comments and he had come over to check my channel and he came across the video that I did on that particular day and he left me a comment. And so we are going to, when I got the comment, I, I was starstruck, I didn't know what to reply. So we are going to go through the comment, what the comment said and why I believe this is the best advice for any small YouTubers because I know I am followed by a lot of small YouTubers and on our channel we help a lot of small YouTubers grow from scratch. We help small YouTubers, we motivate small YouTubers and we give them courage to keep on pushing on their YouTube journey. So we're going to see the comment, what is the comment and yeah, hopefully this will inspire or motivate a small YouTuber out there. It doesn't matter where you are coming from. So yeah, let's go to my phone and see what the comments say. This is one of my best videos since it's got like 102 comments. The majority of my videos, the comments are between 50 and 30. So this is one of my best. So basically what we're just talking about is just giving a shout out to small Namibian YouTubers. And... So basically, that's not, <laughs> that's not what we are talking about in this video. In this video, we are talking about the comment that Wardemeyer left. Here's the comment. And I paint the comment. He says like, There is nothing like small YouTubers. We are all content creators. Wish you all the best. Basically, this is the best advice I think Wardemeyer can ever give to YouTubers who are like you and I. He's basically telling us that there is nothing like small YouTubers, you know, because sometimes when we look at ourselves, we kind of put ourselves down, we consider ourselves to be small YouTubers, and he's just like giving us advice, no, which are, there is nothing like small YouTubers, we're all just content, content creators. So the number of subscribers should not define you, you know. So what, someone has got a million subscribers, someone has got 100k subscribers, someone has got 20 subscribers the number of subscribers should not define you 
and say you are a small youtuber and you are less important you are very important you are just a content creator so he's basically saying like we should not consider ourselves to be small youtubers and this is encouragement for people like you and also encouragement for people like me who we look at our sub count and we think that we deserve more subscribers but the kind of subscribers we have right now they don't really make sense so we have to consider and and i know it's not very it's not very easy you know because you know it's life it's very easy for you to compare yourself to so-called bigger youtubers but uh, what am i is encouraging us that not such thing as small creators not such thing as small youtubers we are all just content creators don't let the sub count define you you are valuable you have something to contribute the sub count the number of views on your channel should not define you we are just all content creators so that's the best best advice that Wodemaya gave me and he's also giving you guys like don't limit yourself don't think that you're just another small youtuber you're a content creator and you are valuable this thing that you are doing you are impacting lives sub count view count doesn't define you guys my name is fernando thank you guys for sticking it this far and this was the best advice that warden maya could give to small youtubers don't think of yourself as a small youtuber you are a content creator i love you guys and i'll see you guys in the next video